Masek Boss believes the finance ministry could have at least engaged with its creditors on the way forward instead of issuing such blanket directive. Speaking in an exclusive interview with Three Business, Dr. Ananianchi believes pensioners will be the most affected. I personally have a problem when individuals are rooking without any uh, conditions at all. So, for example, an individual, and I always talk about pensioners, they've worked their whole life, make a savings, and they have gotten something together and put it in government bonds. And now these people are going to suffer. That is the worrying situation that I have always been uh, talking about, that once you hit the individuals, uh, that is a, a, a major problem than even corporates. The individual is surviving on that little income uh, to, 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 to surviving on that little income. And if that is going to go off completely, like uh, 2023, you are not going to get anything on your, 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 your uh, investment. That is huge. I wouldn't have a problem if the uh, maturity is extended. If the maturity period is extended, fine, to give government the chance to, to, to pay. Interest is reduced. I have suggested that you can increase your interest rates that you are paying to uh, bondholders to some level. But that reduction should not be so uh, much to the extent that you are not going to get even a PESWA on your investment for a whole year.